What is going on, Kane Sport? It's Zuby Charles here at American Heritage High School with 2026 Whiteout Malachi Tony. Malachi, how are we feeling today? Oh, I'm feeling great. Just got done with my spring game. Felt like we played good as a whole team. This is a lot that we need to get better on, just the little things we got to focus on. You catching touchdowns, throwing touchdowns. Just talk to me about that performance, man. Um, I'm just playing the role that my team want me to play. Um, Obviously, this is going on my third year at American Heritage, and I want to be a leader. Mm -hmm. I, I want to be remembered as one of the greats at American Heritage. Talk about being one of the greats. I remember when I first met you, people, you know, said you were a youth football legend. Mm -hmm. You just play all positions. Talk yeah. about, you know, growing up. When, when did you realize you had that special talent? Um, I always wanted to play receiver ever since I was a kid growing up. But I had to play quarterback because my team never had a quarterback. So I just played quarterback, do what, do what I had to do for my team to win. Was there one game in your youth career where you're like, all right, I think I can, I can take this football thing far. You score five touchdowns or anything like that? Oh, yeah. I've been noticed I had God-given talent once. I think it was my eighth birthday. I scored five touchdowns okay. on my birthday. And for you, man, if you played in a Pee Wee game right now, how many <laughs> touchdowns do you think you scored? I'm, I'm going for like eight. Eight? Eight. If you play in Two defense. Two every quarter. Okay, if you play in defense, what's that stat line looking like too? They ain't going to throw the ball like that. I'm going to have 100 tackles, though. For sure, for sure. Would you, Mally, since you're a freshman making plays, you know, for American Heritage, how has these last, you know, two years been for you here? Um, It's been great. They treat me good here. I love it at American Heritage. And with you, you know, committed to the local team, you locked in with the Hurricanes early. Why did you want to commit to Miami, you know, so early in that process for you? Um, they were showing me the most love at the time, and that's what I felt like was the right decision. Well, Coach KB, man, well, what stands out about him? I had the chance to speak with him, but as a recruit, how do you guys connect? He's real. He's a great person. He don't sugarcoat nothing with you. And then with you making a name for yourself on 7 on 7 too, you played for Hellstar, a new team. How was that experience playing with those guys? Um, It was a good experience. They gave me exposure, meeting people that I never thought I'd meet in life. Um, I just shout out to Shawnee, Jews, Coach O, Coach True, Shawnee, Jews, Coach Raul. Shout out to all y'all boys. That drip at Hellstar too, man. Y'all was swagging out. Talk about how you like their clothes and things like yeah. that too. Uh. Everybody knew that's <laughs> all wrong. For sure. If you, Mally, you play real passionate. I like to ask guys, you know, what's your why? What makes you wake up in the morning? You want to grind? You want to be special on that football field? Um, I, want my, I, want, I don't want my mom to work again. So I'll talk, talk about the relationship, man. When you, when you announced your commitment to Miami, she was on that graphic with you. Just how, how big of a role has she played in your life and where you are today? Uh, she played a big role. Without her, I don't think I'll be doing any of this. Without her and my uncles, mm -hmm. they play a big role in my life. And then away from football, you know, who's Malachi Tony? What do you like to do for fun? I'll probably go work out. Work out? Jug machine. Okay, okay, jug machine. Yeah, C Coach Smith said you had the best hands to ever come out this program. What are your thoughts on that? Um, I don't know. Catch <laughs> the ball. Look at the, to the top. For sure. Keep music. The ball. Music, man. Who, who's your go-to artist before a game you turn to get, to get locked in? Young boy. Young boy. What, what young boy song you turn it on? Big truck. Big truck, okay. You got a bar. Let me hear a bar from Big Truck, man. Nah, all the bars. <laughs> you don't want to hear it. You got to play it clean. Everything here. All right. I asked uh, B. Ludis. I asked uh, Zay Thomas. Is there any special talents that you have? Like what? That I'm people want to know about? Yeah, yeah. I don't know, man. I just be chilling. You just be chilling? With you, man, if you weren't playing ball, what do you think you'd be doing? Something sports-wise. Something sports-wise? I make myself good at some sport. Okay, okay. Well, what are three things you can't live without? Uh, football, my phone, and God. All right. Uh, beach or mountains? Beach. Beach. All right. And then last question, Mally. Headed into your junior year, man, what are some things you want to accomplish, you know, next year? What are some goals you have for yourself? Uh, for my junior year, just in general at America. No, just in general. Um, win a state, win a national title, win two state championships back to back, and go undefeated two years in a row. Sure. Malachi, Tony, I appreciate it, man. No problem. Thank you, folks.